welcome back. After seeing the main and critical components like panels and inverters, in this particular segment we will see the protection systems for a solar plant. The protection system in a solar plant consists of four components. The first component is ACDB, AC distribution box. The second component is DCDB, DC distribution box. The third component is lightning protection system and the fourth component is earthing protection system. Let us see them one by one beginning with ACDB. ACDB in a solar plant is installed after the inverter. It receives input from the inverter and feed it into the building's electrical panel and MCB. It has SPD as a protection device. SPD which is surge protection device protects against the surges in electricity and MCB protects against the short circuit and overload. These ACDVs are generally IP65 so that they can also be installed in the outdoor environment. The next component is DCDV. DCDV in a solar plant is installed after the solar panels and before the inverters. So they are placed basically between the solar panels and inverter. They are also known as array junction boxes. The short abbreviation for that is AJB. It has protective devices like SPD, fuses and MCV. SPD protects against any kind of surges in the electricity line. Fuse and MCB protects against the short circuits. DCDB is also used to isolate the solar panels during the maintenance activities. Now let us see what protection we have for the lightning strikes. Lightning protection system is also very important for a solar plant as the structure and framing of the solar panels is completely metallic and has the risk of lightning over them. Therefore, they need to be protected from the lightning strikes. Early streamer emission or conventional type systems are used for the lightning protection. This kind of protection system captures the lightning and safely pass the extremely high current to the ground so that the necessary components like the panels and inverters and structure can be made safe against the lightning strikes. Last component in the protection system is earthing. Let us see about the earthing. Earthing is one of the most important and also most neglected components of electrical installations. This happens in the solar plants too. Critical components like inverters requires a stable earth connection for their trouble free performance. Earthing is also needed to protect any person from an electrical shock due to accidental exposure to the current carrying components. As solar plants life is meant for 25 years. It is very important that a stable earth connection is provided for which an advanced earthing technology like marconite conductive concrete aggregate can be used. It's waterless and maintenance free. It helps in providing the stable performance to reduce the nuisance tripping of the inverters. This was all about the protection systems in a solar power plant. Thank you so much for watching this. I see you in the next segment.